Police pulled up stakes, but some occupiers weren't ready to move. Nine tied themselves together's kitchen tent, the spot where warm soup wine simmered and conversation flowed. They were taken out and released. A man dressed as Batman, too, was briefly detained for allegedly embracing a police officer. This is my revolution, and uh, they don't have a right to do this. But police and blue-collar workers did dismantle the camp erected in Montreal's Victoria Square more than five weeks ago, tagging and bagging, they said, what they could to return it to protesters. So we were going to take down the tents ourselves, and then we were going to replace the tents with art. Early on in the occupation, Montreal's mayor said things were done differently here, that the city would tolerate peaceful protest. But as worries over safety and security grew... And we had to do something. And so, an eviction, much like in other cities. In Edmonton, too, police moved in overnight. We were peacefully asleep uh, when we got woken up by these officers. Look at how many of them are here to remove eight, nine people. But protesters say their movement is too big to fail. That's why I'm here, because I want peace on earth, because I know it is possible to have a, just a better place. Many now say they'll take part in protests, boycotts, and set up and occupy somewhere else in the city. The city has no plans to allow them to plant their flag in another public space anytime soon. Geneviève Beauchemin, CTV News, Montreal.